It's Wild Wednesday, and we're talking about opossums. And we have Haley Perriman with the Dallas Zoo. Thanks for being with us today. Thanks for having me. All right, so we're talking about the difference, first off, between an opossum and a possum. That's right. So here in Texas, we like to call these guys possums. Mm -hmm. But that's actually not true. That's not what these guys are. They're Virginia opossums. They've got that O in the front of their name. Now, right. Possums are found in Australia. They're marsupials over there. But these guys are marsupials too. And you were kind of saying that this is like a little superhero, right? She is. She does this, some cool things. Oh my gosh. She's my favorite animal in the planet. She is able to eat venomous snakes. She's able to eat scorpions. She can eat carrion, which is dead, decaying matter. Um, so she's kind of like nature's garbage man. She can also mm -hmm. eat thousands of ticks throughout her lifetime. Mm -hmm. So she cleans up things like Lyme disease. Does us a big favor. Does a lot of good things. Yeah. Uh, now, Lucy, you said is like three. She's about three and a half, three and a half. though. And that's pretty old for an uh, opossum. That is. These guys don't live a super long life expectancy. One of the main reasons, they have a really high reproductive rate. A single opossum will give birth to 13 babies at once. Wow. Yeah, that, that's, that's pretty, pretty crazy. Okay, so um, and, and, and where can we see Lucy if we want to? Now, Lucy will be found on our Animal Adventures program. So we travel to schools all over North Texas. Mm -hmm. You'll be able to see her there. You can see animals like Lucy at the Dallas Zoo, both at our Wild Encounter stage and in our children's zoo. All right, also at the zoo. Yeah, the zoo light's still going on. We do. That's we pretty do. cool. Isn't it? It's incredible. We've got almost a million lights. And once the animals go to bed, um, it is free with zoo admission. You can come into the park, see almost a million lights hanging out. You can see uh, Christmas carolers, see, uh, have holiday treats, even meet Santa. <laughs> you can't beat that. That's also, true. you have some zoo camps. We do. If you're looking to get the kids out of the house over the holidays, you can send them to the zoo. We've got some zoo camps throughout the holiday season. It's a great way for kids to get out and see some cool critters. Uh, real quick before we go, why do you think the opossum gets such a Bad rat. You know, I think people think they look kind of like a giant rat. Mm. They're kind of misunderstood, yeah. um, and people don't really understand they can be scary. They'll hiss, you know. Yeah. But these guys do us a huge favor. They are like nature's garbage men. That's awesome. All right, uh, thanks for joining us, Haley.